it seem like we feel the same We love what we hate we start ignoring the lies hello guys this is shundel and today shared a reminder to each and every one of us that we can start ignoring the lies what are those lies guys our enemy is a bully and a liar the lies in our lives are those negativity which surrounds us. The lies which is leading us to failure. A lie who lead us to our mistakes. Guys, this is not easy really. Because temptations are lies as well. And it cannot be avoided that we can be easily tempted into something. Tempted not to do our full potential. Tempted to follow the negativity of our mind. Tempted to just stay lazy and not doing the job. Guys, those are lies. And I have to remind you that we can ignore those things and how can we start ignoring the lies guys again respect yourself listen to your own instincts listen to your heart what it is to have to say you have to respect your feelings you have to respect your mindset to turn around the negativity into a positive thing Yes, it's not easy, but guys, really, if you don't like to be bully, then start ignoring the lies. Have a strong, positive mental attitude that you are not going to listen to the lies. What are those lies? Suddenly, thoughts come that you cannot make it. You cannot succeed. You're just going into failure. Those are lies, guys, because really, you can't really make it. But you have to set the right mindset with it. So start ignoring the lies, guys. Start ignoring all the temptations which lead you to failure, which lead you to, to mistakes, which lead you not to success at all. If we really want to be successful in what we are doing, we must keep doing it even we feel tired. Like me, for example, guys, I really want to practice more on my public speaking. I want to share what I have experienced in my life. And this is my passion, talking with you here every day. Since this is my passion, I have to do it every day. I have to read every day. I have to share something with you every day. It's not easy, guys, but you know, we all need a break. So during my break time, I have to read something in the scripture. As you can see, you can download already now in your smartphone, the Bible, the you know, inspirational thoughts. You can download that in your phone. So I have my Bible in my phone, so it's just easy. We're holding, most of the time, we're holding our phone. If you have your Bible downloaded in your phone, it becomes easy for you to scroll down some verses in the scripture which can inspire you. The more you are inspired by the words of the Bible, the more you have the hope, the inspiration, the strength to keep on going. And with that, you become strong in your faith. You, come, you become strong in your own beliefs that you can make it. And by that, 
when you have that good foundation in your heart and in your mind guys it becomes easier for you to ignore the lies the bully in your life yes you can ignore it you are not going to listen to it because you know you are strong and you know what is right and you are doing it for you right you want to be successful it needs hard work so it needs to be done if you are going to listen to the slice then you will feel tired you will feel lazy the schedule doesn't fit there's a lot of alibis not to do what you want to do towards your success then there you are the laziness is a temptation those are the lies in our life and it becomes very difficult to start all over again the moment you stop it as for me guys for example I do the blogging every day. I do the reading every day. And I have to share it with you. The moment I stop for a couple of days because I cannot blog because of the weather and there are always yes, circumstances that I cannot do it. I need to oppose. I need to pray. I need to meditate so I can start all over again. It's all over again and it's Every time we start all over again, it's heavy and you can notice that in your feelings. Oh, it's heavy. I don't like to do it and something like that. But guys, when you have the right mindset and prepare yourself to the thing you want to do and you trust yourself that you can make it, you're believing yourself that you can make it one step at a time. It helps you to be strong, to believe in yourself, and to be more faithful also towards yourself. We need also, guys, to be faithful towards ourselves. And you have to do that. You are the only one who can do that. Guys, to start ignoring the lies, you have to declare to yourself that you are strong. You are not going to feel that weakness when you feel weak of course we are human we can feel weak and discouraged say okay i will feel it now but i will not stay on this place forever i will feel the pain i will feel the laziness take a day or two to have a break and then begin right away start little by little start doing something to yourself guys we are going back again to that loving ourselves to the foolish when you love yourself to the foolish you are going to do things that makes you happy you're going to do things that you feel good with yourself you are going to do things that makes you satisfied and this is my share with you guys really remember that you are the only one who can work with yourself as it says in the scripture, there are a lot of lies, temptations, hindrances in our life. The hindrances, those are lies, guys. So do not be staying on that place. Be strong enough to say to yourself that I have to move forward. I have to do something with my life. I have to take away this feeling of weaknesses. I must be strong. Because you know, you can do that. You can stay strong. And you have to say to yourself, I am strong and courageous. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. When we can acknowledge who created you, who created the universe, there you are, guys. You are aware where you come from. And you are aware that you can make it because you have his power you believe in him you acknowledge him you are aware who created you yes he is the creator of the universe and when we can acknowledge him and we are going to create something for ourselves we are going to create something in our business project or whatsoever we are going to create for our life there he is with you 
in that project. Why you acknowledge Him? He plant that in your heart. And when you are going to love yourself, you have to find out those things that makes you happy, that makes you satisfied and fulfilled. So guys, this is just really a reminder. We all face lies every day. They parent kinds of lies and bullying we face every day. We must just start ignoring it because we can feel it. When you feel weak, when you feel sad, you feel discouraged, those are lies. And when you can feel that, be quick to turn around your mindset, to be aware that you have to do something with that right away. Just for your own sake, and you're doing it for your own sake, for your own goodness, it really helps you guys to move forward. At the same time, asking the Holy Spirit to guide us and lead us every day. Again, I am sharing this with you because these are the tools I am using to survive my day-to-day -day life. Even it seems hard, even it seems so hopeless as, as I can say that to you. Many times I feel so hopeless. I cannot take it anymore because of my illness because of my situation because of my financial problems there are a lot of things guys we are facing in this life but to start ignoring the lies it is about being firm with yourself loving yourself to the fullest doing what is good for you doing what can makes you happy and feel yourself that you are totally full, filled in the things you want to do in your life. So from now on, guys, this is just really a reminder. We can start ignoring the lies. Be quick to change your mindset right away when the lies comes into your mind. This is Yundel. Thank you for listening. Thank you for joining me here in my life journey. I am very grateful to each and every one of you supporting me here in my channel. I love you all and bye. Like we feel the same.